Mosques all around the world and here in the valley have been opening their doors, welcoming people of all faiths. Well, last night a threat was made on an Islamic center in Phoenix. Our Jessica Parsons has more from a mosque in Scottsdale where another vigil will be held tonight. Jessica. We are live at the Islamic Center of the Northeast Valley. People here have already started to arrive. Police are also on site. They have increased a presence here and their patrols. A vigil honoring those killed in New Zealand will begin tonight at 530. But last night at the mosque in Phoenix on 35th Avenue, the United Islamic Center of Arizona, police were called about a man acting suspiciously. Phoenix police tell us he entered the center saying that he was curious about the Muslim religion. He was instructed to sit in on a prayer service, but the center tells us he began wandering around, entering rooms he was not allowed to be in and asking unusual questions. We spoke with Sheikh Fawaz Hossein, who was at the center and on the phone with police. He tells us that when the man was approached by one of the leaders, he put his finger to his neck and made a sawing gesture. So when he made these gestures, so naturally speaking, our mind automatically goes to that incident of uh, New Zealand. So that's why then uh, our board member called the police to just as a matter of precaution. We are terribly sorry for what happened. We don't, we, we don't know your intention. He's still welcome here if his intention was good. Noel Thomas Beck was arrested and booked into the Maricopa County Jail and charged with threatening and intimidating disorderly conduct and trespassing. Now tonight, at least 17 mosques and Islamic organizations from all around the valley will gather here tonight. Um, at this location in North Scottsdale. They are welcoming and encouraging people of all faiths to join in with them to collectively use one voice to condemn the acts in Christ Church. Now the vigil tonight will run from 530 to 630. In North Scottsdale, I'm Jessica Parsons for Arizona's Family.